Peace and love, family. Welcome back to another episode of Michigan Lottery Strategies. Um, today, I want to show you guys this pyramid. Strategy is very simple. You get your numbers right up in there. I mean, it's a strategy you can put in every now and then when you think that they jump in the strategy on you. You know what I'm saying? You know, they got to do it at least once a week. Jump the strategy a couple times. You know what I'm saying? To throw you off to make you not win. So let me, let's go ahead and get this started. Let's write this out. So we start with zero at the top. Then we got Now, yesterday's date was, I mean, yesterday's number was 744. 744. Now, when we go to <clears throat> today's date, the next day, one seven, one seven. All I'm gonna do is add both of those together. So that will make fourteen. And you already know, use the last number. And as I use the last number, I'm gonna go find the four here. <laughs> Another four. We got four right here. We got four right here. We got four right here. Now the number that came out four one seven seven was two thirty eight. This is your one and number, and this is for one six. So 238, and as you can see, we have 238 right around the four. Exactly around the four. So that's how you work this out. You just draw your pyramid out, write your date down, add the last two numbers, come up with your number, and you already know, use the last, and that's the four. And then you go to the four, or whatever your last number is, and you just go around it. See what you could pull from it around it. Whatever numbers you feel comfortable with, write it down. Um, take it in, play it if you want. If you want to change, look for something else. If you want to mirror the numbers, flip them around. However you want to do it. Like I say, Michigan. In Michigan, we have the one-off, so you could play it one-off as well. You know, just in case you feel like it might come with a different type of number, under or over, or something like that. But it all works out. Now, another thing that you could do is you could take, like, we got 744. Now, the double digits kind of throw you off on this strategy as well. But another thing that you could do is you could go straight to the 7, and you could just see exactly what touches it. As you can see, that you got 3 touching it up and down. You go to the 4, you got the 8, and the 2 touching it. So you still comes up with your 238. The other four is way over here. It's not really connected to it, but you get you get my point of what I'm saying. So long as it's touching, you could you could count them in. As you can see, the number is still there. If you would have came over here, you would have the zero touching that four, but the um. 744 is not over here. You just got the 7 right here, the 4 up there. But you got 74 right here, and then you got the 4 way down here. So this, this 4 is a throw-off. So you just connect it with those. And as you can see, the number 238, it came right on out. And you can also use this strategy for your 4 digit as well. So you can win through the pick 3 like this and your pick 4.
Just work them on out. Get your numbers up. See what you want to do. Get your numbers in. Make that money. Peace and love. Good luck.